My name is Thiago Hack. I'm an artist and I'm guiding you through the painting of this funky fish, which is a uh, sea bream. Uh, so first you can see I just did some quick um, outlines of the dark blue uh, to place the composition of the fish. Now I grab the white with the green and the yellow, actually yellow and blue, that makes a light green, and I start mixing it and uh, making the lighter parts, the highlights of the fish. I go straight like that because I want it to fade with the background. So like that, I only make the things that are relevant, that enhance the, the fish. Now I grab some black, I mix it with a bit of blue and I'm outlining and drawing the fish eye and the flippers and everything that is darker color. I grabbed the uh, lighter uh, yellow green uh, to make the um, uh, to make the highlights, um, the backlight effect that I did under and now I mix more white on that color and I make even uh, the highlighter stronger I'm uh, gradually uh, making the highlights more and more bright as my brush gets dirty I add more white to it sometimes a little shade of blue, sometimes a little shade of yellow to get this green effect uh, so I did all those highlights on the top of the fish um, then I'm already signing, no? I signed and I'm working on the top parts of the painting to make some effects of the light coming through as if it was like the ceiling of the water. Um, I was uh, fading those droplets that I left on purpose uh, to make the, the light get some kind of um, dripping motion effects. So I'm, uh, mix, I'm playing with that. Now I grabbed a really thin brush and as you can see I, I did some highlights of dark again. So once we go on light we go back to dark and once we go dark we go back to light and it's back and forward until I'm satisfied with the composition. I'm there uh, correcting under the fish with some blue uh, parts the, the backlight effect. I added a bit of bright blue and the fish is finished. After this I added a little diver on the top of it, a woman diving, because I wanted it to get this surrealist look. And here it is the painting finished, acrylic on canvas.